Alec Pierce, Scuba Tech Tips once again. Here I am in beautiful Silver Springs. I'm sorry about all you guys back in uh, Canada. <laughs> we came down about a week ago and it was uh, 10 below zero and snowing and cold. And I love you all, but you can have it. Here we are, Silver Springs, Florida. Why are we in Silver Springs, Florida? There's no beach here. Because Silver Springs, Florida is where sea hunt is from, a lot of them anyway. And I'm down here with all of my friends from Sea Hunt Forever Group putting on another one of our fantastic sea hunt events. But we're in Silver Springs, where they were filming, and we're actually old gear, all period equipment. You can't have anything newer than 1965. That's right, everything, masks, snorkels, weights, everything has to be old. Suits, that's hard to do. It's particularly hard to get some of my slightly overweight friends now to fit into their suit that they had when they were 15. But it's, anyway, we have a great time. And in the water, putting on scenarios, fighting crocodile, crocodile, alligators and boas and fighting each other, shooting spear guns. We have a great time. If you go to my Sea Hunt playlist, Sea Hunt uh, Remembered playlist, you'll see some of the events. But I'm not here to talk about Sea Hunt. I'm here to talk about tanks. Because a lot of you have asked me about old tanks. Can I use my old tanks? If I have an old tank from when I was a kid, can I still use it? Well, unless you were, a, unless you were born in the 30s, the answer is yes, of course you can. Every tank, and there must be, were there 100 tanks here? There must be 100 tanks here. For all the divers, 25 of us, well, everybody has extra tanks. There's triples and uh, lots of doubles, twins, and lots of singles as well. And every one of these tanks is pre-65. That's right, pre-65. This tank right here, made in 1959. Now, I know, you know, I was a math major. Even I can figure that. 60 years old. 60 years old. You take this tank into your local dive store, there's a good chance he won't even fill it because he thinks it's too old. But I got news for you. This tank is perfectly safe, perfectly usable for two reasons. Number one, it has a fresh hydro stamp. Right there, a fresh hydro stamp. This is hydro in 2014. It's going to have to be done next year again. Fresh hydro stamp, and it's had a visual examination. This is one of those excellent, excellent 72 cubic foot. That's another whole story. We'll talk about that some other time. But it was advertised as 72 cubic feet, 2475 with the overfill, 2250 stamp pressure. That was the tank for many, many years, 30 or 40 years. This was the tank to use. When I started diving in 58, that's the tank that I had, just like that. Galvanized on the outside so it didn't rust. They were just excellent tanks, and they can still be used today. So if you guys do have an old scuba tank kicking around, don't just throw it out. Take it to your local dive store if you want to use it, and say to them, it's real simple, can I get my tank hydro, please? There's no reason why not. That's how they make money. They can get a hydro test done, and the hydro test, as we've talked about earlier, tests the flexibility of the metal to make sure that the metal has not gone brittle over the years or from overuse. It is still flexible, elastic. And so that means it can be filled. And you'll also get a visual examination, particularly with a steel tank, and they will check the inside to be sure there's no corrosion, no rust, nothing else in there. That's Bottom line is they will test the tank and inspect it to be sure it's safe. They'll put the valve back in, get an air fill, and go diving. So there's the answer. So there's a typical old galvanized tank. Now, I want you to look at these tanks over here. These are really nice. And they're also very, very old. These tanks are even older than the earlier ones. These tanks are 57 or 58. There's two of them. These tanks are among, among the original scuba tanks to be brought into North America for scuba diving. In fact, to be perfectly frank, they're not even scuba tanks. That's right. They're not scuba. Originally, they were scuba tanks. If you can look at the bottom of these tanks, I don't know if you can see that, Kevin. Can you see they've got a concave bottom? They have a dish in the bottom. These tanks were actually fire extinguisher tanks at one time. But Ren <coughs> pardon me, Renan Buzo was quite a businessman, and he would buy up those old fire extinguisher tanks, clean them up, test them, paint them, and sell them as scuba tanks. Yeah, he did pretty good that way, too. And here we are now, over 60 years ago, and one of my diver friends here from Sea Hunt Forever has put these into a beautiful set of twin tanks. Obviously, he's painted them. They used to look like this one here. He's painted them a nice galvanized color, beautiful chrome uh, an old uh, manifold, beautifully chromed and clean, old-fashioned uh, bands on it, and he's got an original type of harness. We didn't have backpacks. Well, BCDs, BCDs, you know, what, what the heck was that? We didn't have that. We just had some webbing to hold this thing onto our back, and we went diving. So there's another fine example. These tanks were tested in 2015, just a few years ago, and they have visual examinations, and they're perfect. So 
bottom line to answer your questions, can I use my old scuba tank? Yes, you can. Now, uh, there's some provision in there. Some old scuba tanks are no good. They're rusty or they may not pass hydro and so on. But get it into your local dive store. So I want to use this tank. Take it for a hydro, give it a visual, and bring it back to me so I can start using it. If they don't want to do that, take it to another dive store. Some dive stores are reluctant to use old equipment, but there's no reason why not. Tell them to check out Alec Pierce on Alec Pierce Scuba Tech Tips if they have concerns. <laughs> All right, guys, that's it. A little bit about old tanks. I hope you have fun with your old tanks. Keep in touch. Take a look at our Sea Hunt uh, Remembered playlist as well to see these tanks in actual use. 60 years old. All right, talk to you soon. Alec Pierce Scuba. I'm going diving.